and it is the 15th of February 2016. Once again, to present to you the top three health headlines of the past seven days. To start with, vinegar could potentially treat or help treat ulcerative colitis. Interesting one-two punch to vinegar here. What researchers discovered was the following. This popular liquid could help uh, fight ulcerative colitis and inflammatory bowel disease that research suggested related to the gut microbiome. They found that the vinegar suppressed inflammation inducing proteins while improving the gut's bacterial makeup, at least in animals. The main ingredient they focused in on vinegar was actually acetic acid. Very powerful benefit to vinegar altogether. Number two, barley helps improve blood sugar levels and reduce appetite. This is just consuming barley once per day. Basically a rough barley mixture, about 85% barley, about 15% a wheat. But here we go. Researchers found that participants' metabolism improved up to 14 hours with additional benefits, such as decrease in blood sugar and insulin levels, increasing or increases in insulin sensitivity and improved appetite control. The effects arise in a special mixture of dietary fibers and barley kernel reach the gut, stimulating the increase of good bacteria, once again, and the release of important hormones. They used a bread mixture, which is, according to here, is 85% barley kernels, boiled and mixed with wheat flour. Number three, this is kind of important when it comes to waste treatment. Estrogen antibiotics persisted in dairy farm waste after advanced treatment research finds. When University of Buffalo chemists began studying waste disposal at dairy farms in New York State, they found that the farm's advanced system for processing manure would help remove estrogens and antibiotics from the excrement. So they thought, ready for the punchline here. The treatment process appeared to convert a less harmful form of estrogen into one with greater potential for disrupting the function of animals' endocrine systems, also humans, which produce hormones that regulate growth, reproduction, and other biological functions. Prior to anaerobic digestion, most of the estrogens in the manure, 65% were in the form with lower endocrine disrupting potential. After this advanced treatment or sewage treatment process, which is incorporated uh, in many places, after the process, 72% of the estrogens were in a form with higher endocrine disrupting potential. Totally counterintuitive. You would never think that your waste removal or waste treatment would actually make something far worse. That's the top three headlines of the past week. Thank you very much for listening once again.